Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you how to make tafiri from scratch. Tafiri is also known as dankwa and this snack is very delicious. It is made out of peanuts and corn. Without any further ado, let's get started. For this recipe, you will need raw peanuts, dried corn, sugar, salt, dried peppers, peanut oil, you will need baking trays, transfer the dried corn into the train, transfer the raw peanut into the second train, and spread them out and I'm going to be toasting them in the oven at 350 degree Fahrenheit for 20 to 30 minutes. I'm using two different trains here because I'm transferring them at the same time but they will not be ready at the same time and you can also do this on the stove top. And they are out of the oven for the peanut, I toasted the peanut for 20 minutes and the corn was 30 minutes. I will go ahead to take out the skin from the peanuts. And I'll take it out to blow out the skin and I'll be right back. So here the corn and the pinon, they are ready. It is time to start grinding them. I will be using a dry grinder to grind the corn until it is very smooth. I would advise you to use a dry grinder because the corn is very hard and it can easily destroy the blender. Back home, the corn and the peanuts are taken to a commercial grinder and they are grinded together but i'm going to be grinding them separately because i'm using a smaller grinder here and once that is done i'll take it out and i'm going to repeat the process with the rest of the corn And that is done and here is the grounded corn and this corn is very very smooth so you want the corn to be very smooth like so and I will put that aside next I'll be using food processor to grind the peanuts Transfer the peanut into the food processor. Add in purpose. You can adjust the pepper to your taste. Cover and blend it until it is smooth. You can use a blender to blend the peanuts and you can also use the dry grinder as well. I will stop and use a spatula to adjust the peanuts. I 
I'll cover and let it blend until it is smooth. At this point, the peanut is ready. Add salt, add sugar, add the blended corn. Cover and blend till everything comes together. Feel free to adjust the salt, sugar, and pepper to your taste. Back home, everything is taken to the commercial blender and it's all blended together. And that is done. Transfer it into a bowl. Spray it out. So this is what I have here. It's not dry, it's just perfect. Add in a teaspoon of peanut oil for bonding. And Miss City, everything comes together and my hands are washed already. And mold into your desired size. Dankwa Tofiri is a street snack. It's very delicious and it smells amazing. Dankwa can last for a long time. It can last up to a year, even without putting it in the refrigerator. So if you want yours to last long, you will have to band it with oil. Do not use water. And if you want to get the perfect dankwa, you have to make it from scratch with raw peanuts, roasted and dry corn, just as shown in this video. And I want to say a big thank you to all my subscribers. Thank you all so much. You guys are amazing. And if you are not subscribed, Please subscribe put on the notification bell which will notify you each time I upload any new video and feel free to share my video and like the video as well And that is done and they are ready and this is what the dankwa looks like it's very very delicious and this smells amazing I'm just gonna have a bite and show you how it looks like and this is what it looks like 
if you've not tried this nas before give it a try and let me know what you think about it i want to thank you all so much for watching remain blessed and i will see you in my next video bye